Oh god. Right, Wendy! The best Koopaling? There's no such thing as a good Koopaling, so. Bowser Jr. Bowser Jr. isn't good. I mean, not as a character in this game, no, but I mean, Bowser Jr. is pretty cool. Oh, well, as in, like, just, just, as looking, like at their actual just looking at them on their own? Yeah, Bowser Jr. is pretty cool. Oh, do, who's the best Koopaling, then? Bowser Jr. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I could agree with that. But does he count as a Koopaling? I mean... Or is he different? I mean, he's... Uh, I want to say you could, you could count him as a Koopaling. I mean, he's not one of, like, the eight Koopalings, or seven Koopalings. But I mean, you know, he, he might as well be a Koopling. Oh, they have the stage list written down in the paper. It's always a good thing to have. Yeah. There, there are a lot of stages. Just having like a uh, piece of paper in front of the setup is this is good. Yo, was that a Team Instinct T-shirt I see over there? That's pretty sick. I can tell. Is it? It's uh, the guy in the hat right there. Too bad it's Team Mystic. Too bad it isn't <laughs> Team Mystic. Um, Yo, Team Mystic, though. Smash. Smash. Ninja Metroid. Ninja Metroid. But which Metroid character does he use? If he doesn't use a Metroid character, then... Uh, I'm going to take a gander. He uses... Ridley. I was going to say Dark Samus. Ridley. Possibly. I mean, you got. Why wouldn't he use the best? You have a twenty-five percent chance of getting, getting it right. Well, then we're wrong. Period. <sighs> all right. So, uh, villager and a Pokemon trainer. All right. What? Why would you not have? Man. Why would you not just have you? <laughs> I'm upset. <laughs> It'd be like that sometimes, my dude. Well, I mean, hey, Mewtwo King doesn't use Mewtwo, so... Yeah, but Mewtwo King's different. Yeah, Mewtwo King has just earned the title of Mewtwo King in general. Let's go, Pikachu. Uh, wireless controllers are banned. Wireless controllers are indeed banned. Trash, bro. Wait, no, Chris. Chris, here at Gwinnett Brawl? No, no, they're not. Oh, okay. Yeah. This. Wow. I got jabated. Like, mega hard there. Mega jabated. Yo! If you play with the wild control and my street setup, you best be safe to put out the eyes of the DQ you! Basically, the moral of... He's mad. The, the moral of wireless controllers is make uh, sure you desync it. Otherwise, de you'll, make Papa, you'll make Papa Chris mad. Papa Chris. Papa Chris. I'm really glad he's not over here to hear that. <laughs> yeah, otherwise he'd probably hurt me. <laughs> um. Hey, yo, how, what's going on? Buddy? This just in, it was Loco's controller. Lol! <laughs> <laughs> Rip. Ripperoni, Loco. All right, it's a three v one, clearly. Chris, you have to, you have to keep, you have to keep by your word. He's DQ'd. He's the you by your word. Oh, okay. Uh, it was definitely game cube control. Uh, just saying. <laughs> <laughs> Out of here! You guys automatically lose. <laughs> you know, if we can stay, it'll just be two v one. Why would you do that? I mean, Locos Locos DQ'd, so you know. Uh, yeah. It sucks. It, it happens sometimes. Rest in peace. Rob! Rob, village, true link in anything. Um. So I guess I'm, I'm going to assume that Tiki is Ninja Metroid. Thus, all three of us were wrong. Yeah! It's not even playing Pokemon Trainer. This is no Pokemon Trainer, no Metroid. Inkling. Inkling. Oh, that! Oh, now we villager. What is happening down there? He's a villager. He, we live in. He's Rob. He's living as well. 
You know, there's that change that they made to Rob aesthetically where, like, he's got the little gas gauge on... On his on side. On his yeah, side. Yeah, it's really cool. I mean, it's cool, but, like, I don't think... I, mean, I personally don't think it's, like, that big of a change. I mean, well, whenever you're in the yeah, heat, whenever you're in the heat of the match, I mean, you're not really going to be focusing on that. Well, yeah, it might not be, like, too big a change, but remember that... The Smash Ultimate. Smash. They didn't have to give Mario, like... Uh, Cappy, they didn't have to like. They didn't give have to give Mario. <laughs> but they wanted to. Yeah. I mean, Sakurai could have taken Mario out of the game if he really wanted to. Sakurai could have had nothing but Bayonetta. Yeah, he could have made Bayonetta the only character. <laughs> All right, let's go. Ninja Metroid taking out the first stock. So it looks like. Uh, I have trees. Just it, for whatever reason, it it looks like he's pocketed an energy-based projectile, but all he's got is gyro. Well, maybe it counts as an uh, energy-based. You ever think of that? If it does, then I've, my life is a lie. I I did not know. Can Rob just stay down there for a few seconds and just not decide to recover? Yeah. I, I've I've seen nothing of Rob before this tournament. Really? Um, yeah. Do you know anything about of, the fact that he could do like Nair side B? Nope. He can do Nair gyro trains, and then side B kills really early. Mm. Do like Nair side B on the uh, ledge, that'll kill off the side of like 30%. It's it's dumb. And Flay um, Loco really struggling to find the kill on. Uh, yeah. No, not Flame Loco. Loco um, is living forever. I have right trees and I have trees in Ninja Metroid. Is it they're having trouble finding the kill on. He uh, won't. On he Loco. just won't die. <laughs> He's at 195. Um, if he keeps up, he'll be at 200. <laughs> I want to see him at 200. 207. Let's go. 207 and not dead yet. Um, I mean, right in between both of them, and neither of them get anything to kill. Um, Oh, let's go! All the way out for that kill. Um, getting the side bit that you had just mentioned, but yeah, that goes to the blast zone. That's side B's actually just a really good off-stage option for Rob. Oh my gosh, Loco, just die already! <laughs> he just kills wrong, his teammate, teammate with a nair. <laughs> he kills his own teammate before he himself loses his first stock. All right. Oof. All right, Loco is just staying Loco? alive. Like I have trees, and Ninja Metroid just can't find the kill. Oh, uh, why do I say this? Finally, these finally, Flea finds the kill <laughs> with the net. Well, team kill, but wow, a two for I see. No, that, that was a strat. It's some mental damage. Uh, Flea was saying, "I'm gonna kill my own teammate before you guys kill him." That's the strat, dude. He's trying, to, he, he's trying to tilt them, my dude. Mm. See, it works. He lost his stock. <laughs> dude, this is just orange, orange oh. tuning right now. Okay, that was really he cool is for a second. Fully was... inked. Oh, he tried to go for the table grab for whatever reason. We just roll up smash. Finally, that's my second game one. Basic ending, but yeah, uh, not up smash, up smash, up smash. But basic ending to the game, but an ending. Yeah, I like Rob. Rob's pretty cool. I don't know enough about Rob. Neither do I, but I mean, he's in Smash, so he must be cool. Um, I don't think that's how that works. It's exactly how it works. I mean, are you just going to add someone who's not cool? Yeah. I mean, fair. Yeah. Corin. Corin. <laughs> <laughs> who, who wanted Corin? I mean... That's not cool. Probably nobody, but... Uh, there was at least one person who wanted Corin. I mean... You know, Attica. But, but Attica, but Attica wanted... Attica, I mean, fair. But I mean, if Etika wants it in the game, nobody else matters as long as Etika wants it. That 
this would be like an adults only game. If Fair. Erica got everything Fair. he wanted. It'd be rated M. No. It'd be rated like Yeah, it'd be rated M. It'd be like rated Z or something. I don't know. You'd have to it's go like on some shady websites to find it. You'd have to go on the, the, the deep one. <laughs> That's that I'm trying. I'm trying not to mention anything. Alright. I want someone to go Incineroar. How do you feel? Uh, they're not going no? to Cinderor. You don't want someone to go in Cinderor, Chris? Why not? Because I want the match to finish. Oh. Well, I mean, Cinderor's got a pretty terrible recovery, so I mean, you know. <laughs> Wave though. Can can I just have someone go in Cinderor? Is that too much to ask? Yeah. Not a lot of people play in Cinderor. I play in Cinderor. No, you don't. Oh, I play yeah. Lucina. My secondary. This is just, there's a whole lot of commotion going on. A uh, whole lot of projectiles going on. A whole lot of everything. I thought he was dead for Can a second. Can you count villagers forward and back airs projectiles? Yes. Can you? I pocketed. You can pocket and reflect them. Uh, I guess you can count. Just, Yo, well, like, <laughs> would, well, do you count, like, Mega Man's lemons? They're a projectile. I mean, yeah. You know, my favorite thing about uh, Rob is whenever people just like, they use it up B and then like, they just flick the control stick up and down a bunch. And then, you just Rob. What does that do? Uh, I mean, I think if you hold up, it uses gas, uses more gas than if you just flick it up. You'll still keep the momentum of using it like once, but like, you'll use a little bit less gas. At least I think that's how that works. I mean, they, hopefully they just don't live, they just gotta let Loco not live to 200% again. That's, uh, that's really like the reason, I feel like that's the reason why they lost game one, just because they could not find a way to get, uh, get Loco's first, first stock off. Oh, well, man. Oh, there you go, you got what you wanted. They, yeah. Um, Loco losing his first stock. Uh, I mean, you get stage bike by Inklings up B, and then he directional air dodge. I, I bet he was trying to tech there, but he accidentally buffed yeah. the air dodge instead. All right. He's in oh, the this, win is box a, of this is a pretty even game. Sure. I'm honestly just kind of waiting for something to happen. Oh, yep, there, that's something that happened. Uh, um, I have Trees losing his second stock of game two. Well, it's um, it looks like a fairly even game. Yeah, overall everyone's so, playing. Certainly more than, certainly more even than game one. Yeah. Um, but I'm calling it right now. If this goes to game three, uh, Loku's gonna live to 200% at least one more time. I'm, gonna, I'm feel, I feel like it's gonna happen. If this goes to game three? Like, if they win this game, and he doesn't live to 200% this game, it'll probably happen game three. I feel like playing a heavy character in doubles is just really beneficial, just because you, you live forever, and you can almost carry your team like that. If you really need to stay alive for your teammate, then you know, playing someone heavy is, is good. It's useful. And I don't think you're going to get your wish of uh, game Yeah, three. probably not. And it I mean, if anything, Flea's probably going to live to 200% now. Ooh! Flea's I like that update. Nah, Flea's not going to live. You don't know, man. It could happen. Okay, it could happen. It's Oof. not going to happen. The Florida felt like it would have killed. It might happen. He's almost at 200%. <laughs> he needs to live to 200. It. Ooh, nice, nice down it's throw. It's not gonna oh, happen. Down tilt. No, down air up air. I mean, he's just gonna. Plain. He's just gonna camp on ledge. Not even he, on ledge. He just barely off the side of the stage. He just barely just avoided thorn. that. He's, Did they he's nerf just Rob's up throw? I guess, maybe. Dude, that sent him nowhere. 
There? No. It's not Dude, even. This is just an onslaught of projectiles. He can. He's having a really hard time getting back okay. to stage. Okay. He got to 200. Uh, there we go. There. There. <laughs> Two the everybody. Well.